Hello, today I'll show you how to create a custom flash message or on Flutter it called a snake bar. Pretty handy to show errors, success or any warning message to the user. If you like to follow along with me, download the starting project. The assets directory contains all of our assets and the lib directory contains the main.dirt and flash message screen.dirt. Flash message screen is nothing, just a simple screen with a center button. We already have a snake bar wizard on Flutter to show such error or warning messages. To display it using scaffold messenger, inside the snake bar the content is a simple text. If you click on the show message button at the bottom it shows a snake bar. I know it looks pretty simple but don't worry, we'll make it great. First let's change the behavior, floating is perfect. Again click on the button as you can see already looks much better. Wrap the text wizard with a container then set the height to 90 and the color to a red color. Click on the button for preview, but it's not what you expected. To fix that, need to set the snake bar background color to transparent. Still, it looks a bit weird because of the shadow. Set the elevation to zero. Everything is gone. Now, no shadow or white border. Add a padding of 16 to the container. To make the container rounded, apply a 20 border radius. As you can see, slowly we are getting in shape. Now wrap the text widget with a column, add another text. Set the font size to 18 and color to white. Same for the next one, font color is white and the font size is 12. Least but not the least, there will be max 2 lines of text. Also set the overflow to text overflow dot ellipsis. Set the alignment to start. We need free space on the left side to place bubbles and close icon. Wrap the column with a row, define a size box and set the width to 48. Also wrap the column with an expanded wizard. Now we have a good amount of free space on the left side. To place the bubbles, wrap the whole container with a stack wizard. The bubble is a simple SVG image but Flutter does not support SVG by default. I already added the Flutter SVG package to the starting project. Now copy the image path, then add it after the container wizard. Let's see how it looks. Set the height to 48 and width to 40. And set the color to more deep red. We want our bubble to the bottom left side. For that, wrap it with a positioned wizard and set the bottom to 0. As you can see, the bottom left corner is not rounded anymore. Let's make it rounded by setting the border radius at the bottom left to 20. Perfect. We are almost there. Last but not least, add another SBG called fail.sbg and set the height to 40. We want it to the top left corner. To make it happen, wrap the image with a positioned wizard and set the top to minus 20 and left 0. Now we have a problem. To fix that, set stack clip behavior to none. To place close icon on this top bubble, wrap it with a stack wizard. Inside the children, add an SBG image called close.sbg and set the height to 16. The close icon on the top right corner, to make it center, set the stack alignment to center. Still it's not center, now wrap the close icon with a positioned wizard, then set top is equal to 10. Yeah, now it's perfect. Let's add a proper error text, something like email is already in used. It would be better if we had more space between those two lines, add a spacer and we have it now. We are almost done, let's remove those underlines by adding const. We are done with our custom flash message on Flutter. You need to use this flash message in many places on any app. To make it reusable, let's extract snack bar content, I'm gonna call it custom snack bar content. Create a required parameter for error text, then pass the error. I hope you love this video. You can check our premium shop UI kit link in the description.